Valor, this submarine was commissioned by the U.S. Navy during the Cold War between 1958 and 1964. This submarine patrolled off of the coast of the Soviet Union, about 20 miles away from its coast, 300 feet underwater submerged, with 100 men downstairs waiting to receive orders from the U.S. Navy to the to deploy the Regulus-1 missile. The Regulus-1 missile is the jet uh, cruise control guided missile that you saw outside before coming in. It looks like a plane, but the wings fold in and they fit into this hangar deck. That missile is so powerful that it can destroy a whole city by itself. It's about 200 times the power of the Hiroshima, Nagasaki, and all of the other World War II atomic bombs combined. We had four of those Regulus-1 missiles in the submarine, hiding underwater, 20 miles only away from the Soviet Union. Uh, there were two Regulus-1 missiles in one hangar deck, two in this one. So these hangar decks is where missiles are stored. So the problem about, about all this and why it lasted only six years is because, number one, this submarine had to come up from its hiding spot and be visible to the Soviets. And number two, it took 15 minutes uh, to deploy the missile after being up on the surface. So, uh, the missile, if the U.S. Navy ever gave the orders to deploy the missile, they had to come up and then stay above water for 15 minutes waiting to eject the missile, put it on a ramp, up on a platform, and eject. By the time 15 minutes were up, the Soviets would have burned this submarine down to its ashes.